السلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته أصدقائي Hello everyone, I hope you are all doing well So for the newcomers, أصدقائنا الجدد I am Mesa, your teacher of English Welcome to my channel In today's video, we are going to enjoy a new story سنستمتع بقصة جديدة بما أنها الجمعة So, and Sorry, and we are going to learn new words, new expressions as usual. لكن قبل البدء بالفيديو لا تنسوا الاشتراك في القناة ضغط على زر لايك كتابة تعليق مشجع سأقرأ كل تعليقاتكم وأجيب عليها بإذن الله ولما لا مشاركة الفيديو مع كل أصدقائكم حتى تعم الفائدة بإذن الله. So today's story entitled Story of Elephant and the Ant. The elephant and the ant. Elephant, el fil, and the ant, el namla. Qissa el fil, wa namla. The elephant and the ant. Let's start the story. Once upon a time, there lived a big elephant in the jungle. As the elephant was much bigger than all the other animals, he would always trouble them. نعيد بصوت مرتفع وببطء. دائما أعيد ما أقرأ بصوت مرتفع وببطء. In the same forest, there lived a family of ants. They were a hard-working family who always would go to gather food. Right? In the same forest, forest غابة, there lived a family of ants. They were a hard-working family who always would go to gather food. One day, As they were walking, a big, mean elephant threw water on them. The ant got angry and asked the elephant to stop troubling others. Right? One day, as they were walking, big, mean elephant threw water on them. The ant got angry and asked the elephant to stop troubling them. But the elephant shouted at the ant to shut her mouth, or else he will walk over all of them. Right? But the elephant shouted Salaha at the ant. To shut her foot, to shut her mouth. Sorry, to shut her mouth, or else he will walk over all of them. The next day, the ants noticed the sleeping elephant. The ant thought. Of teaching a lesson to the elephant. The next day, the ants noticed the sleeping elephant. The ant thought of teaching a lesson to the elephant. أعيد ما أقرأ بصوت مرتفع وببطء. She quietly climbed onto the elephant's trunk and entered it. Once inside, she started biting the elephant. Right? She quietly climbed onto the elephant's trunk and entered it. Once inside, she started biting the elephant. Once inside, she started biting the elephant. 
The elephant shouted because of pain. The elephant shouted because of pain. He tried everything but couldn't get the ant to stop biting him or come out of its trunk. Right? The elephant shouted because of the pain. He tried everything but couldn't get the ant to stop biting him or come out of its trunk. Such an enormous elephant became useless ahead of the tiny ant. The elephant pleaded to stop or to the ant to stop biting. Right? Such an enormous elephant became useless ahead of the tiny ant. The elephant pleaded to the ant to stop biting. The ant stopped and said, Well, I hope no, you know how others will feel when you hurt them. The elephant said, Yes, I do. Please stop now. Right? The ant stopped and said, Well, I hope no, you know how others will feel when you hurt them. The elephant said, Yes, I do. Please stop now. The ant stopped and came out of its trunk. The elephant apologized to the ant and promised never to disturb others again. Right? The ant stopped and came out of its trunk. The elephant apologized to the ant and promised never to disturb others again. والآن اكتبوا لي في التعليقات ماذا تعلمتم من القصة؟ ما هي العبرة من القصة؟ وإلى هنا أصدقائي نصل إلى نهاية الفيديو. Thanks a lot for watching. شكرا. لا تنسوا أن تدعموني بالاشتراك في القناة الضغط على زر لايك. كتاب التعليق ولما لا مشاركة الفيديو مع كل أصدقائكم. See you.